Hey guys, welcome back to the Third Floor Arcade. This is Jason, and today I'm on a mission to beat my high score on the Burger Time cabinet. Um, I've always been a huge Burger Time fan, been playing this since the, uh, I guess it's been since the late 80s. Um, it's probably one of my favorite arcade games from that uh, decade. Um, my current high score on the Arcade 1-Up cabinet stands at 43,500, um, so, and I'm feeling pretty good about beating this score tonight. So let's check out some Burger Time action. All right, guys, here we have the uh, Burger Time cabinet from Arcade 1-Up. Um, I've had this probably for about two months, I think. Um, I've been playing Burger Time probably since uh, the late 80s. Um, uh, here we go. Here's my top five scores. Uh, my Golden Knight is to beat that high score of 43,500. Uh, before I get started, I have yet to install the uh, new gates that um, Arcade 1-Up sent, the original um, when they sent it out, had uh, eight-way gates, and it was supposed to be a four-way joystick. But uh, I'll definitely get those installed sometime soon. Just been really busy. So let's uh, let's jump into this. I get one one shot here. Let's see if I can beat this uh, forty-three thousand five hundred. Definitely a huge Burger Time fan. I think it's uh, it's up there amongst the uh, my favorite games from uh, that eighties decade. Right, off to a bad start. Messed up there already. Um, so what do you guys think of the uh, Arcade 1-Up announcements uh, last night? They uh, announced the uh, Big Buck Hunter, Miss Pac-Man, and, um, and of course the uh, Marvel vs. Capcom. Of those three cabs, I think um, I'm going to get two of those. And that's uh, definitely Big Buck Hunter. And um, Marvel vs. Capcom for sure. That big buck hunter looks freaking awesome. Ah, there we go. Ah, that was not very good for the first level. Six thousand four hundred. Usually the goal for the first level is like eight. What uh, what do you guys think of um, of this cabinet so far? I know it got a lot of mixed reviews. A lot of people hating on uh, Karate Champ, and uh, I think Caveman Ninja. But um, I don't know. That's not really the reason I bought this. I bought it for uh, Burger Time and um, Bad Dudes. But overall, I love this cabinet. I think I'm definitely going to have to get rid of some cabinets, though, with uh, all these new ones coming out. Got some uh, tough decisions to make coming up. I think I'm definitely going to get rid of um, the Galaga, since that's on the, um, the new Pac-Man 40th anniversary. Uh, possibly the Street Fighter, too. I'm sure a lot of you guys are running out, starting to run out of room that are uh, collecting these things. Yikes! Oh my gosh. Whew. All right, level two is done. Thank you. 
This game gets a, it's a lot of fun, these later levels. Those fries. Just got a free guy. Ugh. Having some close calls here. Alright, that was level three. On to level four. I love this level. This level you can really rack up some points. to that uh, big buck hunter man that machine just looks awesome burned a lot of peppers there I'm not doing good uh. need that pepper oh no stock up on some peppers or I'm in trouble here. Oh no. I think I'm in trouble. Out of pepper. Yeah, I'm dead. Not a bad performance though. 40,000. Oh wait, got one more guy. I didn't even realize. Am I gonna beat the high score? Oh man. I forget what my high score was. 43 something? Ah, no! So I finished with a uh, second place score 41,950. Unfortunately, I did not beat my high score, but uh, came kind of close. This game is definitely a lot of fun. If you, uh, people watching, if you haven't tried this yet, it's a great game. All right, guys, thanks for checking out the third floor arcade. Please like and subscribe. I have a ton more videos coming including the uh, review for the NBA Jam Arcade 1-Up Cabinet, which I should have next week. Uh, talk to you guys soon. Bye.